Hey, what's up? It's Chuck again, and in this video we're going to talk about animated camera switching in Blender. Okay, so here we are in Blender. This is version 2.82, by the way. Um, so we have our little default cube here, and we have three cameras in the outliner. So camera one is just a wide shot. Camera two, if we hit control numpad zero after we select that camera, uh, that is a close up shot. And then camera three, control numpad zero to move to that camera, is just a little animated shot. Okay, so let's assume that throughout the animation we want to switch between these three cameras. Really easy to do. All you want to do is add markers in the timeline for wherever you want to switch cameras. So you can do that by he either hitting M on the keyboard in the timeline, or you can go to Marker, Add Marker. <clears throat> so we have a marker here, and what we'll do is bind the first camera, Cam 1, to this marker. So we select the marker, go to the Marker menu, and select Bind Camera to Markers. So whichever camera you have selected at the moment, let's select Camera 1, will bind to that marker. Okay, so we'll move forward a little bit to frame 25, let's say. We'll add another marker and let's select camera two and we'll bind that camera to the marker, okay? So we start out on camera one and then it switches to camera two. We'll move forward a little bit to frame 50. We'll add a third marker. We'll select camera three and bind camera three to that marker. You'll also notice that it names these markers according to the camera that you have bound to them, which is really nice. So now when we play through the animation, start on one, switch to two, switch to three. It's that simple. And you can move these around really easily. Just click and drag them if you wanna change the timing at which the camera switches. So that's it, super simple, easy way to do camera switching in Blender, and when you render it out, it'll render all those cameras in sequence.